स्टैंडर्ड सिक्स सब्जेक्ट इंग्लिश पोएम नंबर थ्री पॉइंट फाइव द डोंकी बिफोर स्टार्ट दिस पोएम आई वुड लाइक टू गिव यू शॉर्ट इंट्रोडक्शन द पोएम द डोंकी डिस्क्राइब्स द बिहेवियर ऑफ अ न्यू बॉर्न बेबी डोंकी फॉर होम लाइफ इज अ न्यू एक्सपीरियंस एज ही इज टेकिंग द फर्स्ट स्टेप्स ऑफ हिज लाइफ ही क्लम्सली ट्राइज टू वॉक अराउंड हिज यूज हैड एंड शेकी लूज लेग्स मेकिंग इट ऑल द मोर डिफिकल्ट फॉर हिम टू डू सो the poems ends with the poet hoping that the world around the baby donkey would treat him with a care so this was the short introduction related to this poem now i'm going to recite this poem for you all please pay attention here i start i saw a donkey one day old his head was too big for his neck to hold his legs were shaky and long and loose they rocketed and staggered and weren't must use he tried to gamble and fix a bit but he wasn't quite sure of the trick of it his queer little coat was soft and gray and curled at his neck in a lovely way his face was wistful and left no doubt that he felt life needed some thinking about so he blundered around in venture some quest and then lay flat on the ground to rest he looked so little and weak and slim i prayed the world might be good to him so dear children i have recited this poem for you all now one by one i have explained each stanza your i start i saw a donkey one day old now your poet is saying that he saw a donkey that oh, just one day old the baby donkey was his head was too big for his neck to hold so his the baby donkey head was too big for his neck to hold his leg was shaky and long and loose so the baby donkey leg was very shaky very thin and long and loose they rocketed now what is meant by rocketed rocketed means to move suddenly so the baby donkey was moving here and there and staggered now what is meant by staggered staggered means moved weakly and unsteadily and weren't much you so the poet saw a donkey that was just one day old baby donkey the donkey head was too big and heavy for his weak neck to hold his leg was very loose and weak type because he was just one day old baby born so he was trying to stand and run here and there because of his big head and loosey leg he was not able to walk properly so here the poet is trying trying to tell us that the newborn donkey for whom the life is new experience as he is taking the first step of his life and try to walk around his huge head and shaky legs it is making difficult for him to do that let's move to the next stanza of the poem he tried to gamble now what is meant by gamble gamble means to leap and jump playfully so here the donkey the baby donkey was trying to play leap and jump here and there and fix a bit now what is meant by fix fix means to skip and dance so here the baby donkey was trying to dance and jump here and there but he wasn't quite sure of the trick of it his cruel little coat was soft and gray so the baby donkey was having hair on his head which was very soft and gray and curled at his neck in a lovely way and it was having curled hair near his neck which was looking very lovely so in the second stanza the poet is trying to tell us the donkey the baby donkey tried to run and leap playfully but he did not seem quite sure because how it was done his peculiar little coat was soft and gray and it was looking lovely the curled near by his neck it was pretty way let's move to the next stanza of the poem 
His face was wasteful. Now, what is mean by wasteful? Wasteful means full of hope, longing for something. Means something hoping for. So here, the donkey face was wasteful and left no doubt that he felt life needed something thinking about. So it was thinking something about. So he blundered. Now, what is mean by blunder? Blunder means move around. Awkwardly, so here the baby donkey was just wandering around without any worry. He was just wandering around here and there in venturesome. Now, what is mean by venturesome? Venturesome means daring or adventurous. Quest. Now, what is mean by quest? Quest means search that act of looking for something and then lay flat on the ground to rest. So after running here and there, the baby donkey get tired and lay down flat on the ground for rest. In the third stanza, the poet says that his face looked seriously, almost as if he was thinking of something, or he was hoping and appeared of thinking about his life. Feeling adventurous, he moved around awkwardly without any effort. He was moving around and searching for something, and all. Thing he had tried, then he feel like tired. Then he lay flat on the ground to rest. Let's move to the last stanza of the poem. He looked so little and weak and slim. Now, what is mean by slim? Slim means thin, or you can say the slender. So here, the baby donkey who was very little and weak and slim, very thin. So I pray the world might be good to him. So here, the poet is doing prayer that the whole world might be good to him. In the last stanza, the poet realizes how puny he was and hope that the world treated the baby donkey with love and care. The poet worry that the baby donkey is very small and weak, and this world is very new to him. So he just prayed to God that the world would be kind and loving to him. Dear children, hope you all understood this lovely poem. Thank you.